A binary operation asterisk is defined on the set of positive integers such that x asterisk y is equal to 2x minus 3y plus 2 for all positive integers x and y. The binary operation is a commutative and uh, closed on the set of positive integers, b neither commutative nor closed on the set of positive integers, c commutative but not closed on the set of positive integers, d not commutative but closed on the set of positive integers. Let's write the rule of combination, which is what x asterisk y is equal to 2x minus 3y plus 2. Commutative. The condition for commutativity is that x asterisk y will be equal to y asterisk x. We already have an x asterisk y. Therefore, y asterisk x will be equal to 2y minus 3x plus 2. So you can see that then, x asterisk y will not be equal to y asterisk x. x asterisk y is not equal to y asterisk x. Therefore, the operation is not commutative. Not commutative. Let's go to the options. Anyone that is saying commutative, let's just rule it out. It can never be our option. So it can never be the correct answer. So option A is wrong. The same thing, option C is wrong. <clears throat> we are left with option B, which says it is what? Not commutative, at the same time not closed. Now let's go for closure and see what's going to happen. What is the condition for closure? If x and y are element of, uh, let's say, positive, uh, positive integers. After we have applied then, our rule of combination, if the answer we are going to get is also a positive integer, that means the operation is closed. But if the answer we are going to get is not a positive integer, that is, the only condition for this to be closed is if x asterisk y is also an element of what? Positive integers. So, but if not, then it is not closed. Okay, our rule of combination says that x asterisk y is equal to 2x minus 3y plus 2. This operation may be closed and may not be closed. On what condition can it be closed? So, if um, the answer we are going to get for this is going to be a kind of a, a positive answer also, then it is closed. But take for instance, if let's evaluate 1 asterisk 5, is this going to give us a positive answer? We have 2 times 1 minus 3 times 5 plus 2. So you can see that the answer we are going to get from this is going to be minus 11. So it is not closed under this but if we evaluate other values it can be closed therefore i will tell you that none of the option is correct but for the sake of an uh, if you are inside the example i know that they are actually talking about an uh, option d which says that what not commutative but closed on the set of positive integers yes it can be closed for some integers but not on all integers just like i have demonstrated in this uh, example 1 asterisk 5. It is not closed because our answer is minus 11. And minus 11 is not a positive integer. So it can only be closed when it gives a positive integer because x and y are positive integers. Therefore, the answer or the question does not contain a valid and correct answer. Because the answer can be what? Option B or option T. It can be closed and it may not be closed depending on the value of what x and y. Thanks for watching. We have come to the end of this tutorial. In case you have any question, you can put it in the comment section.